All right, while well, all that is heating, it's side quest time. The blacks are done drying. My bad. Now it's time to put the whites in there. I'm gonna get canceled one of these days. I've sugar more than everyone. Sorry about the WWE entrance. <laughs> My bad. For Bob, bro. for Bob that commented yesterday, can't wait for tomorrow's banger. Meaning this video. I'm sorry, this video is not gonna be a banger. It's just gonna be a lot of cleaning. You know what I mean? How would you end up there? It's not like I put you up there or anything. So cringe, bro. You already know what we're gonna start off with, ladies and gentlemen. They're deep into the log there. I don't know. I don't see them, but it's all good. Feed time. Sometimes I feel like they're not grateful for what I do for them. Because, bro, I'd feed them and everything, and then, like, they don't eat it until, like, I'm gone. <laughs> like, what? But I get it, though. They're just playing hard to get. It is what it is. Just another one of those productive days, you know what I'm saying? Your boys go flush this down here real quick. We got laundry. We got a lot of stuff to throw away. <laughs> that reminded me of the Philippines. For those of you that are wondering why, in the Philippines, most of the time, we don't have like an automatic flusher. There's no switch. So what we would do is we would dump a bucket of water in there and flush it that way. Yeah. It was only a kiss. It was only It's killing me. I feel like the air conditioning box needs to be thrown away like really soon too. We're just gonna throw this on the way out right now. It's segregation time. It's my favorite part of the day, boys. Segregation. It's gonna be taken out of context, bro. Not bad. Alright boys, we're at Walmart right now. I wanna get those towels that don't like shed i hate those ones low lint perfect this is the one so the goal for today's walmart trip is for me to not have to get fast food all the time so i'm gonna try to do is that i'm gonna try to get a bunch of like raw meat and stuff raw ingredients because we like it raw you know that's pretty much what this trip is going to consist of is just getting a bunch of like raw ingredients you know cajun seasoning ton of butter sausage that's at least one of the foods that i want to make i want to go back to a more healthy diet you know what i mean i'm still gonna dirty bulk let me be honest but like i want to i want to get better at not doing that as much god dang it what a glizzy holy shit. i think that's enough sausage i'm gonna put a little bit of lemon zest on there because your boy likes it a little zesty but i don't know when i'm gonna cook it but i'll cook it eventually all right if i have like a day off sometime this week i'll we'll run it is there like frozen corn but this is literally exactly what i wanted Freaking perfect, dude. And I think after this, I want to go to the Asian store and go grab some Filipino food. I guess all I need is here, man. Again, boys, I might have to stop at the deli section. Feeling like queso right now. With butter masala sauce for seven bucks. Might have found my dinner, boys. I'm curious. I'm curious. I, you, you, you captured my interest. I'm gonna go check out now. Move on to the next store, boys. I don't want none. I just want you. If I can't have you, no one will. I'm a of course, my top songs of 2023 has this. Come on, man. Uh. She was a fast machine, she kept them up, and we were making it of you. <laughs> Could be chasing, but my time would be wasted. They got nothing on you, baby. Oh, it hurts so hard. For a million different reasons, you took the best of my heart. Asian store time. Try to get hot dogs. I think I think we're gonna stick to the hot dogs. I think that's it for now. I do want to save a little bit of money too. Lots of options. How many ops you really got? I mean, it's too many ops. The pass on the spot from John Stockton. Beat your ass and have the Bible of God line. You know what we'll do? We'll buy two of these. Ten bucks. I wanted to get Filipino ramen, also known as Punchy Tempo. It's the goat. That's why. I'm just kind of parading here, see what I can find, you know what I mean? There's no certain direction. I'm kind of buying to buy, you know what I mean? I'm gonna make a vow to myself that I'm not gonna be eating like fast food or anything crazy until like next week. I spent $35 at Walmart, and here I think I'm gonna be spending 20 bucks, give or take, which isn't too bad. Yeah, 20 bucks, a little more than that. Alright, guess how much this is. If you said eight bucks, yeah, you're right. Oh, what the fuck? Five, five, five tuna. We'll get two of these. Spicy pack seal. Freaking love cans of tuna, bro. It's so good. We're just stocking up, you know what I mean? I need to do this more often. We're over like 30 some dollars. We're pushing 40 here. I'm gonna get a thing of candy, though. See you in the apartment, ladies and gentlemen. I gotta check out real quick.
And we're back. Ladies and lady boys, welcome back to another episode of Aldwin Cooks. I believe the last time I cooked was I, I cooked curry. This time we're going to be cooking this thing right here, which I don't, oh shit. I don't have a can open. This is going to be a bit of a problem. I'm not going to lie, but we're going to go get them loaded, right? So what this is, let me talk about it real quick. This is Argentina corned beef. And for some of you that are curious to what this tastes like, because you know, you, you probably had corned beef as well. So it's like, why is it $9? Why is it $8 and I think 49 cents? Yeah. Well, one because it's imported, yeah. <laughs> No sh But also, I think it just tastes a lot better than normal corn, corn, no, corn. I think it just tastes a lot better than normal corn beef, you know what I mean? Normally with normal corn beef that I get from like Walmart or something, I'd have to kind of doctor it up a little bit. This one, not so much. Heat and eat, you know what I mean? And the Argentina brand is what we use in the Philippines. I don't know, man. It's just, it's just really good. I haven't done this in a long time, all right? Let me tell you a little backstory here. So in the Philippines, whenever we would have like a can of like food or something. Oh yeah, by the way, the fire alarms, whatever. Whenever we would have a can, we don't have a can opener. So we just kind of go the old fashioned way by just doing this and there we go and then you just you just go around like this and it's a little dangerous but you know sometimes you gotta bleed for the goodness you know what i mean just keep going around of course try not to cut yourself that's bad news my grandma would definitely be proud of this she'd be like no 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 no, don't do it i'll do it myself be like nah grandma i'm gonna be the one doing it now i remember the situation happened this was in the philippines right when like i said whenever there's a can around uh and we have to open it you just have to do it manually while i had like a it's called fresca tuna it's kind of like this but it's uh it's a different brand i remember one time i brought a can home i was like all right i'm gonna open it and grandma's like no 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 no, no. Don't, don't do that i'll do it myself i had no choice but to oblige because you know what i mean it's like i had to trust the export i could not say no to the expert okay i think that that's fine all right heat on all right there what ladies and gentlemen it's pan time oh number four give or take as i mentioned this is pretty much heat and eat you know what i mean it's not too deep and what am i preparing this for this is for lunch tomorrow i'm gonna split this up so it's more than one lunch session or eat session i'm gonna start pre-making some food so i don't i don't have to like struggle finding food ideas or whatever and i also don't have to spend money now to add a little bit more substance into this rather than just meat itself i'm also gonna add some eggs and scramble it in there and at the same time i'm also gonna make two sunny side up eggs so each plate's gonna look like rice corned beef and then a uh, sunny side up egg all right boys oil has been mixed in there now it's time to mix this boy in there some light see the thing is right i could be wrong but i believe you can actually eat this raw pause, pause. i'm just happy that aldwin cooks is back finally cooking some stuff up again shut up oh my god all right while well, all that is heating it's side quest time this is done dry the blacks are done drying my bad. Now it's time to put the whites in there. I'm gonna get canceled one of these days. You know what, man? Feel free. If you want to cancel me, go ahead. I do want to know what it feels like to be canceled. I'm just curious, just for research purposes, all right? I'm not gonna lie. I should have turned the heat up a little bit, you know? I'll just let it cook, let it do its thing. Boys, the fishies are out. You see him? Bro, he was out for a second. Damn. Brother was teasing me, man. That's not fair. It's all good, though. I guess I go f myself. So my actual dinner tonight is the Indian food. This is for tomorrow. As I mentioned, I'm gonna turn the heat up here. I do like it to be a little bit crispy, you know what I mean? Adds a bit of texture when I bite into it. Look at that, man. Let it cook. I forgot how fatty this was. I shouldn't have added the oil. Oh well. What can you do? Sal good. I guess I go for And this is taking a little bit of time. God damn. Start cooking, you son of a bitch. Alright, another side quest. Washing the dishes. Yes, sir. Boys, it is quite important to wash the dishes, right? Let me tell you that. Because without the dishes being washed, what are you gonna put the food into? Your mouth? No. No, I swear to God, if that actually destroyed my microphone, I would have been, I'm, I'm, I would be incredibly upset. The thing is, right, I still can't believe this thing is 180 something dollars, 190. And this isn't even the pro version. There's a pro version of this that's like 100 and like 200, 210, 220, something like that. It's like, bro, God dang. That's a little excessive, don't we think? Guitar Center. Or a task cam, I guess. Task cam. They're the ones responsible for the price. I mean, it is good quality though, so it's, uh, I can't really complain, right? All right, now boys, look at this. Ooh, it's crazy. Spin up. It's starting to crisp up. It's starting to crisp. Yes. Bro, why do you guys watch me? Uh, the next part, eggs. Uh, not only does it add more substance, it adds more proteins. Uh, I guess that's part of substance. I guess it makes it taste better too. Different texture and also kind of like a placebo effect. It makes you think that there's more corned beef, even though you know damn well there isn't. It's just 
just the eggs. And now we stir, boys. And then that's pretty much this dish. It's it's really easy. That's the thing. Like, I, I love easy dishes to make. But I also like the challenge of having to make, like, this, like, complex dish or whatever. There's some days where I'm just like, eh, let's make it simple. And then now we just keep stirring it until it's properly mixed in there. It should taste really good. Now it's, like, pretty much fully integrated in there. Now it's just a matter of just waiting until it cooks, you know what I mean? Because, of course, the, the egg is still slimy. You don't really want that. I'm not rocky. You know what? Here's an unpopular opinion. I have had raw egg before. I remember I did it for like a challenge like God knows how many years ago. That's when it used to be called Hardcore Challenger for the really, 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 really OGs, you know? If you remember those days, man, shout yourself out. But uh, point was, I've tried raw egg before. And honestly, I like it. I don't know. Does that make me a sicko? Maybe. I don't know. That's just my opinion. I, th I think it's I think it's actually decent. Like, it's good. Oh, yeah. That's the stuff right there, Sonny. I wish we had, like, peppers or something. If we had, like, jalapenos or something, I definitely would have uh, gone with that. Plop on some jalapenos on this. Now, here's the thing. We also like to add into the ingredients list. This is a Filipino thing, you know what I mean? It's this thing called Magic Setup. I don't think it's artificial flavoring. Well, like it kind of is, I guess. They sell it as kind of like an all-natural... What's the word for it? GM? No. I forgot what it's called. God damn it. This is called an all-in-one seasoning thing. What a decent amount. Nothing crazy. There. They claim it's all-natural, so I guess I'll believe it. At this point, it's pretty much cooked. I just gotta let it crisp up a little bit. That's all it is, really. It's ready to be put on the on the old container here. The only reason why I'm putting on the container right away is because I gotta cook eggs. Not like scrambled egg, but like sunny side up eggs. So there's there's no room. But hey, I gotta get a thumbnail though. Give me a sec. All right, my bad. I just, gotta, just had to get that thumbnail. You know what I'm saying? Because for those of you that don't know, I am a YouTube vlogger. Of course I need a thumbnail. Oh, that's the best right there. It's starting to crisp. Oh yeah, there's some crispy parts now. Not burnt, but like, you know. Crispy, like I said. And then here you go. Here's a little transition, all right? All right, now we got corned beef right here. And then... Boom. So, corned beef and eggs, ladies and gentlemen. Look at this. There you go. There's my little thumbnail, I guess. I got a couple thumbnail ideas, but we are now done. This is gonna... There we go. Yep. In conclusion, this is my lunch for tomorrow. This, and I also got this. It's just a good day, ladies and gentlemen, all right? I'm gonna wash these dishes, and I think, uh, I think that's it to conclude this video. If I have other things to add in this video, I'll, I'll put it up. But for now, I think that's the end of this video. I told you guys it wasn't gonna be a banger. Today's just one of those days where just kind of living life, you know what I mean? Just doing the normal things that I usually do. This is a routine day. Cleaning up, cooking, okay, getting ready for other things, which, by the way, this Sunday is gonna be a fire video, all right? Yeah, it's kind of- I didn't mean to say that, but that's kind of a spoiler. But either way, it's gonna be a very interesting video for Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. For me, at least. For you guys, it'll be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. But either way, for now, I'm gonna end this video. If there's more, I'll be adding more. Yeah. Good. I like a pro, but you're really a novice.